Hi everyone, Marion here with Butler and Badu Portraits. Welcome back. Today we're going to be talking about personal brand and the top three things that you can do to establish a personal brand. So first of all, why is it important? Why does it even matter? Um, because all our lives are online so often and it's a really cool way that you can connect with the right people and build your tribe and find opportunities and amplify your voice. And even if you decide that you want a smaller smaller presence on social media, it's still really important because we should all be wanting to put out quality content, make quality interactions, and having an idea of who you are not only helps you as a person in your day-to-day -day life, but it helps you be able to know what things are worth your time, worth your energy, and just helps make a lot of things come together. So the first thing that you need to do when you're trying to figure out your personal brand is Figure out who you are, figure out what you want to stand for, figure what your values and your purpose are, what your goals in life are. This might take, well, this should take a little bit of homework because it's going to take a little bit of time to drill down to exactly what that is. For me, and I wrote it down because it's important, I want my life to be an example of femininity, growth, discipline, leadership, accountability, and being the best I can be at whatever I'm putting my hand to. I also want to use my gifts to empower women um, to find confidence and opportunity. It's something that I do in my day-to-day -day with my photography. It's something that I believe in fundamentally as a human being, and it's taken some time to figure it out, but it's really important to me. And I wanna identify and connect with people that are like-minded and want similar things. Your values might look different from what mine are, and they probably do because you're a different person than I am, but you need to figure out what exactly makes you you and be authentic to that and then also be unapologetic about it you're not going to connect with the right people if you don't don't feel comfortable with who you are as a person and so figuring out what that is is a big deal so look at it in both your personal and your professional life because this is your personal brand and you want to be able to put yourself out there in ways that um really speak to who you are as a person say for example um something doesn't align with it you, uh, you shouldn't post about it. You don't really want to talk about it because then it doesn't align with your personal, personal values and your personal feelings. The second thing that you want to do is you want to connect and serve the people that you, um, that are important to who you are, the people that are, that are your tribe, are your community. And you want to connect with them, yes, but you also want to think of ways to serve them. And you might be thinking, I've thought about it too, um, what can I offer? What exactly? Why would people listen to me? Um, when you do that work of trying to figure out what your voice is and who you are as an authentic person, you're going to be able to know a lot faster and easier who your people are. And then you'll be able to tell what are some things that I can create, that I can put out into social media, into the universe that helps me serve those people, to share with them in a way that can help them. This is a really... Um, good way to see social media. It's not, it doesn't need to be a waste of time. It doesn't need to be just entertainment unless you're serving people through entertainment, but it can be a way for you to educate and form. Um, it's a really good way to elevate your time online to be something more than just throwaway time. And then the third way that you can build your personal brand, which is what I work with a ton of people on as they're trying to figure out exactly how this looks um, with professional photography services, is tell your story um, and that helps with communicating with your tribe with your people but you want to um, do that education and inspiring by telling stories by helping people really truly understand who you are and what's important to you uh, talk about your day-to-day -day, talk about your thoughts and feelings on different issues talk, talk about examples that you've seen in other people's lives all these are ways that are going to um, help other people be enjoyable, um, help you have fun online also. So the biggest thing also too, is that if you can work with somebody who does professional photography, that's able to give you some tips and tricks, that's a good way to elevate the pictures that you post online. The It helps to train your eye to know what's good photography, what's good video work, um, why do I like certain things, why are these professional quality and uh, a good starting point is to have a professional photo session to be able to go through that experience and get the results of that. Use that to post also online um, and use that as a springboard to your journey on
helping you build your personal brand and put your beautiful face out there so that you can serve and connect with more people. Thank you so much.